All right, people, the Wickenburg PD just showed up, and look at what's going on. They're going to try to shut her, they're going to try to shut Deb and the horseshoe down. Hopefully, they are going to, we don't know what's going to happen, but right now, this is what's happening in our, in our country right now. When you've got the Wickenburg Police Department coming in here to try to give her a citation, and I'm guessing that's what it is, and uh, to try to shut this down. So, we don't know what the end result is going to be. So, so it looks like they're trying to shut her down. So it's another business owner that they are trying to enforce the law. They're, I mean, they're, what's happening? Ladies and gentlemen, I've been told I have to close my restaurant. Um, I'm not closing. So they will have to arrest me because I refuse to close. Yay! Yeah! Thank wrong. you, everybody. I appreciate you so much. Right on, Mama. All right? I refuse to shut my business, so I'm going to stay open. And they'll probably be here to arrest me later on this afternoon, if not sooner. Did, so did they threaten you with arrest? Is that what uh, happened? I told them I would refuse to close. Okay. But he didn't say he was going to arrest you yet? I said yeah. you'll have to arrest okay. me. Okay. That will just cost you more money. Doing the business owners. Thank you for supporting me. I appreciate you very much. I was just served paperwork from the state of Arizona, executive order, that I have got to close my restaurant. That I'm allowed to do takeout and takeout only by Governor Ducey. <laughs> okay? Uh, thank you. Thank you. I am not in compliance, and until everybody understands what it's like to be where I'm at. And you've lost a lot of revenue, haven't you, been I closed? I have lost yeah. up to 90% of my revenue. There was one day she only made $20. That's it. How can a restaurant survive off of that? And, uh... So... I told them I refused to close. And I told the police officer, I'm sorry, and he's a really nice guy and a friend of mine, which makes it really hard for him and I. But uh, I'm not going to conform. We, I won't. Yeah. And Did they say they're coming back later? He said, I or said. Or how long do you have to comply with the order? I'm supposed to comply as of right now. And I already told So you're told supposed him, to tell everyone it's like Yes, and I already told him I wasn't going to do it. And he, I felt really sorry for him because he did, he'll probably have to come back and be the arresting officer. But I'm going to do it. I don't care anymore.